I was looking for a looking for a show. We had a space, and we had to we had to come up with a show uh, in Fort Worth last year, and so then I came I came upon Marianne's work. The first painting that really struck me was this uh, tall, lone figure over here. She studied. She grew up in Chicago, and she early on she uh, took some classes from. Uh, the Art Institute of Chicago, she got uh, some scholarships to go there. Then they moved to Texas. She did a lot of classes in the um, Dallas Museum of Art with, uh, you know, well-known Dallas painters like Otis Dozier and Jerry Bywaters. Uh, but she didn't, she didn't go get her uh, master's degree until she was 69 at the uh, University of Texas at Dallas. She studied with a uh, a well-known painter who was uh, teaching there at the time, uh, Kazuyo Sakai. Um, so anyway, so we found Marianne's work. We had a show. We discovered Allison, who was uh, speaking through the ages on similar topics, and uh, kind of brought them together. And uh, they kind of this is the second show we've had like this, where these uh, paintings kind of speak to each other. And so with that, I want to introduce Allison. Um. The collage for me represents societal uh, subconscious um, and how we have to cope day in and day out with the bombardment of the media um, and how that bombardment and sort of the fleeting way that catastrophic and death is presented um, desensitizes us to the point where we forget that you know all these people died yesterday because something else has presented us to us in the media. And something I learned recently uh, that I thought was really interesting. There are only six corporations that uh, control 90% of the media in the United States. I don't know if you that. I did not know that. Six. That's my control. It's me. <laughs> so um, Disney's one of them, actually, one of the six. GE, uh, Time Warner, uh, Viacom. I can't remember the others. Anyway, so um, the painting in my my pieces represent current day. So I use urban settings, um, sort of the hustle and bustle of every day and how we go about our everyday business while we're constantly thinking about all this stuff that's being thrown at us, all the media bombarding us with all this information. And a lot of our choices are guided by the media. So, you know, when you make a choice, you have to think about those six corporations are guiding you to choose certain things in your life. So is this really my choice, or am I being influenced by Disney, GE, or whoever is throwing stuff at me that, that day? 